Welcome to another video on SAP Datasphere, SAP's cloud data warehouse solution. SAP Datasphere empowers businesses by integrating data from multiple sources, such as SAP and non-SAP, and it's able to deliver actionable insights. With its data warehouse as a service approach, SAP Datasphere provides agility and flexibility in data management. So let's take a quick look at some of the key functional components of SAP Datasphere. Let's start with the spaces concept. Spaces allow you to separate data and models based on teams and departments, allowing for flexible modeling, monitoring, and managing of data, something we will discuss in a future video. On the data integration front, you have the option to integrate data from on-premise as well as cloud data sources. An SAP data sphere supports virtual data access as well as real-time replication, like scheduled replication and a classic ETL approach using data flows. The data builder is a powerful modeling tool allowing you to unify and harmonize data in a standardized way, either using a graphical tool or a SQL editor. The business builder enables your analysts to create models independent of your IT team and using business friendly modeling tools, allowing them to map a model to the data layer. On the administration side, you have tools for managing the connectivity, auditing, security settings, and creating data access controls, ensuring governance and compliance across different layers. The semantic onboarding option creates a hub for importing semantically rich data objects, enabling integration, for example, with systems such as your SAP S4 environment. On the consumption layer, you can seamlessly integrate SAP Analytics Cloud and SAP Data Sphere, as well as third-party BI tools, and hook them up to your models for analytics as well as reporting. And with the fully integrated data marketplace, you have the option to acquire third-party analytical data sets and integrate those with your existing SAP Data Sphere models. The data catalog allows for a centralized metadata management, which is able to increase productivity, helps building trust in your data through improved quality and governance. So now let's talk about the combination of SAP Datasphere and BW for HANA. In case you're using BW or BW for HANA today, a hybrid deployment with SAP Datasphere is giving you the best of both worlds and you can extend your existing on-premise data warehouse with the flexibility of SAP Datasphere. With the SAP BW Bridge as an add-on to SAP Datasphere, you also have the ability to move your existing BW or BW for HANA assets to SAP Datasphere. More on that in a later video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos on SAP Datasphere and SAP Analytics Cloud. See you next time.